Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're telling me this is the best use I've had all day. I was just about to run out. Yeah, I'm literally... Yeah, I'm going to put the video together right now. I'm sending it straight through to Ben and Jones. He's going to love this. Yep. All right, cool. Fantastic. Thanks, brother. Cheers. Bye. Oh, my God. You people are about to... Let me let me adjust this for a second. Are we good? You good? Yeah. I was just about to run out to the gym, and I just got a phone call from my lawyer. The best news I've heard all freaking day. All week, actually. So, Ben Johns, let's, let's give you a bit of a recap in case you haven't really been paying attention. <clears throat> ben Johns, the operation manager of Iris Pro Wrestling, decided that he would issue me a fine for $850. He would then try to suspend me for 30 days, which would take me out of the next two events, Revenge and the Fallout. We, we, we can't have this. Look, Ben, High Risk Pro Wrestling is about making money. And for those that aren't aware, Blake Mitchell actually has uh, an interest in high risk pro wrestling, if, if, if that's the way you want to put it. I actually own a portion of the company. Now, due to uh, me being an active wrestler on the roster and going for titles and everything else that everyone else uh, wants to do in the company there, it's a conflict of interest if I had any say over the creative control of the company, per se. So that's why I appointed someone that I trusted and was a good friend of mine for 10 plus years, being the current operations manager, Ben Johns. Ben Johns then wanted to fine me $850 and suspend me for 30 days for giving the pop drop DDT to referee Jack Rossley at Heatwave. Now look, the problem here is, Ben, you don't actually have enough grounds to, to suspend me or fine me $850. As a matter of fact, I spoke to my lawyer and he said that in turn, um, due to, basically what you're doing there is a defamation of character uh, all over the internet, all over Facebook, all over the website and everything else. So apart from this being a company issue, it's also becoming a personal issue. Now, Ben Johns, I'm also aware that Irish Pro Wrestling is your only employment, therefore your only sole income, and you're a single dad. So basically, it goes like this. You either drop the fine and suspension, or I'm going to sue the shit out of you for every single penny you've got on a personal level, and then I'm going to kick your ass straight out of high risk pro wrestling as soon as I get approval for that. So Ben Johns, basically you've got one option. If you don't want to go to court and get your ass kicked by me, the option is this. And basically I'm going to do it for you because, well... You don't really have a choice in the matter unless you want to be homeless. So basically the thing is this, you're going to drop the $850 fine, you're also going to drop the 30 day suspension, and out of goodwill, so I don't sue the shit out of you for defamation of character uh, and slander, um, but basically out of goodwill, you're going to give me a high risk pro wrestling world heavyweight championship matchup just like I deserve next Friday night at Revenge. That's right, I'm, I, I'm aware you got your little rematch with Orlando Jordan returning, uh, facing David Hawk in the rematch for the title. So what I've done is I'm going to make it easy for you, Ben. You don't have to add or, or change anything because I've done it all for you. I've spoken to the board and everybody else has agreed it has to happen. <laughs> so basically what's going to happen is this, Orlando Jordan, David Hawk for the HRPW title and Blake Mitchell. Three-way dance next Friday night at Revenge. Blake Mitchell, Orlando Jordan, David Hawk next Friday night. 23rd of March, tickets still available. Revenge, be there to watch Blake the Man Mitchell get his belt back. God, this is sweet, Ben. No fine, no suspension, all this commotion for nothing. And even better yet, I'm going to walk out with the High Risk Pro Wrestling World Heavyweight Championship. <laughs> God, this feels good. I'm going to call the hallmark. This is too good to be true.